Have you ever felt that, what will you do where your car is stolen? This is the only solution for you to track your vehicle. This is a vehicle tracking device which can operate using your mobile phone. Shall we check the device before everything? Thank you for the given support by subscribing my channel. I ordered this GPS car tracking device from AliExpress. The device was received within two weeks. Let's open the package to see the inside. You can see everything are well packed in the package. This is SOS message sending button. You can send instant messages. And this is the relay socket to connect fuel cut relay. You can use this mic to listen the talking inside the vehicle. This is the door cable, it will detect the door is opened or closed. This 12 volt relay is given to control the fuel power cut or reconnect. You can connect this repay with the given socket. This cable is for supply power to the GPS tracker. And there is a double tape to stick the device. This is the GPS tracing device. All the operations are with this device. You need to enter a SIM card to this device. This is the way of opening SIM tray and I will show how to insert a SIM. Then the most important part, the user manual. Do not lose this user manual because all the things you need to set up and operating codes are in this user manual. Read all before installation. These are the accessories found inside the package. Now we are going to connect all the parts together with the car GPS tracking device. Watch the video. This is the wiring diagram. You can follow this wiring diagram to install the unit. When you are connecting accessories, you do not need to worry as there are separate unique connectors to connect each part. Now you and insert the SIM card. The thing is, you have to insert a regular SIM card. You cannot install a micro SIM or nano SIM. Put the SIM correctly on the tray and lock the SIM tray. If you see the inside, you can then there is a battery with 200 mAh and 3.7 volts. It is rechargeable and this will work as a backup unit. And the back side, there is a GPS antenna mounted to the unit. You have to switch on this small switch while working as it is the battery switch. I gave power to the device to check the unit. You need to connect battery wire and accessories wire together to power the unit. You can see the indicator lights as well. There is an special application to control and communicate with the device. Scan the QR code in the user manual and download the application. You can get is to Android and Apple devices as well. In order to access the device, you have to enter the EMI number of your device and enter the password as 123456, you can change the password later. Once you are logged in, you can track the vehicle real time. And also if you have connected the relay to the fuel power line, you can cut the fuel supply as well. This is how I track my vehicle route.
This is very important, you can get GPRS alert to the app when the vehicle engine is on or it is off. Want to answer the things taking inside the car, you can call the GPS unit S7 phone number and it will be answered automatically. In order to activate that facility, you have to send an SMS to the device. Type monitor and the password then send. Now the facility is activated then you can call. When you receive the device, you have to enter the following code to activate. Then you can fix the admin phone number using following code. If you want to change the password, send the following code. You can cut off fuel or power connected to the relay using following code. This will be executed when the engine speed is less than 20 km per hour. If you want to cut it quickly, you can enter following code. You can resume cut off fuel or power connected to the relay using following code. You can check the status using following code. I hope you now know how to install the car GPS tracking device. I will see you with another project. Until, be innovative and, stay with Setinfix.